Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys. Peak game. All right, about to watch Manny Pacquiao, Keith Thurman, again with the sound off so I can get a clearer indication. Just watch with the sound off. It's always fun to watch a fight with the sound off because, like I said, sometimes these uh, analysts are biased and pro one fighter. But let me take the time out to further expose the fans and how finicky they are when it comes to certain situations. In particular, let's talk about CompuBox. Real talk. Because I'm finna take the time to expose these fake Fairweather bandwagon fans. You know, real talk. Okay. <clears throat> so let me show you how the media and the fans flip-flop when certain certain things are agenda driven all right let's go back to andre ward sergey kovalov one no need to talk about part two because we already know how part two ended but keep in mind the first fight was very controversial you know you had andre ward uh winning the first fight a lot of people thought sergey kovalov should have won the fight i thought ward won now keep in mind what was the biggest argument that a lot of these people were making about Andre Ward, Sergey Kovalov won? That they were bitching and whining about. They was talking about CompuBox. Oh, CompuBox said that uh, Sergey Kovalov landed more punches, plus he knocked Andre Ward down. So that means he won the fight. Okay. Okay. Let's go to December. December 2018, Deontay Wilder, Tyson Fury. Okay. Now, we all know what happened in the 12th round. Deontay Wilder floored Tyson Fury. You know, and I thought that was enough to win him the fight. He knocked him down twice, possibly three, but he didn't get credit for one. But what was people saying after that fight? Well, if you look at the company box numbers, you will see that Tyson Fury should have won because he landed more punches. Okay. Now, once again, let's revisit Manny Pacquiao. Keith Thurman. Now, all of a sudden, now that Keith Thurman landed more punches, the hell with CompuBox. Oh, Manny Pacquiao knocked Keith Thurman down. So that was enough to win him the fight. Now, this is what the fans be saying. This is what the announcers are saying. Okay, well, if that's the case, then, then, okay. If you're going to go by that logic, then who landed more punches, then that mean if you, okay, let's call a square, square, and a circle, a circle. So if you're going to go by that logic, if you one of the people that think Deontay Wilder lost to Tyson Fury, and that Andre Ward lost to Sergey Kovalov in the first fight, then that means Manny Pacquiao lost to Keith Thurman, right? Because what do all those fights have in common? Okay. There was a knockdown. Okay. So I'm just saying. I'm just I'm I'm just saying. See, now you see, I, I bet you the room getting real quiet now. I would love to see how you guys going to try to explain your way out of this. I know I'm stupid. I'm ignorant. I know I'm I'm a racist. I know so on. I'm just catching you guys and calling you on your bullshit. How you change the scenario or change, you know, the narrative when it comes to a certain fighter. And it's ironic with Andre Ward. And Deontay Wilder, they happen to look a certain way. So you draw your own conclusion what I'm saying out of that. But at the end of the day, it was easy to expose you guys. So I'm just saying, if Keith Thurman landed more punches, based off y'all logic, that means he should have won the fight, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. Anyway, this your boy Town Biz. I'm out.